Hey guys, welcome to Mod Library. Today we're looking at a mod for Fallout New Vegas called Vault HQ1 by KRL10. Now, this mod is a player home that's located just north of the General Goods Store in Good Springs. In the house, you'll find some interesting features. You have a NPC you named mean? Alice Bunny who will take care of the fields outside. She collects the plants and she trades with Chet and Trudy over the Prospector Saloon. And she's even nice enough to leave the proceeds in a safe down in the bunker. Now the house itself has a variety of rooms. You've got a kitchen, a you know, living room, a bedroom. Now making our way down to the bunker, the author has added a workshop just before you get inside the vault that has your reloading bench and your crafting bench, um, variety of equipment, uh, the soda machine, and a firing range that your companions will actually use if you have them in sandbox mode down here. Now once you've completed Alice's quest, she will give you access to Evan, who is the computer system that runs the vault, and you'll be able to open the vault door. And the author has really gone out of his way to make tiny little details work. The, all the light switches actually work in the game. The projector can be changed to what it projects. You can turn it on and off. Um, he really has gone out of his way to make this a highly detailed player home. And the vault itself is equipped with a full armory with ammo, weapons, and armor. I would like to see the author put out a release without all the ammo and weapons, as many players will think that's kind of a cheat, especially if you're going to use the house early on in the game. And the last feature of this bunker that I'd like to show off is probably one of the coolest. The bunker comes with its own security system, and that would be the... Uh, what is that? Protectatron robot that you can set to patrol uh, one of the two floors, or both floors, uh, whichever one you want. And the other part of the security system is these wicked looking machine guns that once deployed will come down from the ceiling, you'll get the alarms going off. Uh, definitely cool, and I would love to see these things rip into a couple of bandits trying to get into my bunker. I definitely have to rank this bunker as one of the higher quality player homes, right up there with the underground bunker and the underwater bunker. If you're looking for a player home that's near Good Springs that you can get access to almost right away in the game, uh, this is definitely a good choice. Well that wraps up this episode of Mod Library. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel for more modding goodness, and as always, thanks for watching.